Hi, I'm William Everhart, Director of Training here at Lodestone, and I have a Photoshop quick tip that I'd like to share with you. Masks are an integral part to any Photoshop workflow, but many times it's next to impossible to see the edge of your mask. This makes it difficult to know where you've applied the mask and where you haven't. So in this quick tip, I'm going to show you exactly how you can reveal your masks and then hide them again. Here I have my image open in Photoshop, and if you take a look over in the upper right hand corner of the screen, in my layers panel I have two adjustment layers applied. The first one here is a black and white adjustment. If I turn that on, you can very plainly see exactly where the edge of the mask is. You could take a brush and you could paint on that mask, either adding more color or uh, taking away the color, but it's very, very easy to see exactly where the mask edge is. Well, what about situations where it's not so easy to see? I'm going to turn off that black and white layer and then take a look at this hue saturation adjustment. Now this particular layer allows the apples to kind of pop with color here. I'm going to turn it off and on again just one more time and you can see these apples here in the center. They're kind of flat here but when I turn this on, wow, they really pop to life. But where does it stop and where does it start? Well, let's take a look. If I start painting over here on some of these apples, eh, I can kind of sort of see it but it's not very apparent. So this is where the quick tip comes in. If you take a look at your keyboard, on the right hand side you have a return key and just above that you should have a backslash key. It should be presented right next door to the right hand bracket or right curly brace key. If I tap that key, wow, my screen turns red. That is actually the indicator of the mask for this particular adjustment layer. If I tap that backslash key again, the red goes away. Now, whether the red is there or not, you can still paint or erase to really see the edge of your mask. So that's it. The quick tip for today. Using the backslash key to toggle the visibility of layer masks. Thanks for watching. For more quick tips or more in-depth training, have a look at the Lodestone website at www.lodestone.com.